Hi guys, welcome to my new After Effects video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to make this animation with Duik Basil 2 and After Effects. Let's get started. So, vectors from freepy.com, I will add download link and project files. First step, let's make a little rig. Select these eyes. Let's pair onto this head. Select this nose, mask, eyebrow. And again, pair onto this head. Select this head, go to solo. And click this icon for see background. Let's zoom to object. Select this palm behind icon. Move the anchor point here. Click selection tool and unsolo. Then select this head, pair onto this body. Select this body, go to solo. And move the anchor point down. And click selection tool. Let's unsolo. Okay, let's press air, let's see. Okay, nice. Then let's make puppet pins for this left hand and right hand. Select this hand one, go to solo and let's click this icon for black background let's go to select puppet pin tool and make one puppet here one here and one here click selection tool go to here change puppet engine legacy click ok then select this puppet go to window open duik basil tool and click this icon for go to rigging and when we selected puppets let's click add bones okay let's select this bone let's see nice and this then let's select this puppet pin 3 pair onto this puppet pin 2 select this puppet pin 2 pair onto this puppet pin 1 and select this three puppets or bones go to click auto rig i key okay let's select this controller and let's see okay very nice let's unsolo all these objects let's see okay good so let's select this hand two go to solo and go to puppet pin again let's add one puppet here one here and one here click selection tool and go to again puppet engine change legacy and select this puppet go to add bones and select this puppet pin three pair onto this two select this two pair onto this one and let's select these three puppets Go to Duke again, click Auto Rig I key. Let's see. Okay, nice. Let's unsolo all these objects. Let's see. Okay, we're nice. Let's select this file and pair on this controller 2. Let's see, select the controller 2. Okay, we're nice. So in this time. Let's select this puppet pin 1 and this puppet pin 1. Let's pair onto this body. So let's select this body, press air, let's see. Okay, nice. Rigging is down. Let's select this hair, pair onto this head. Select this body again, let's see. Okay, very nice. And press P. Let's try again. Okay, very nice. So, our rig is done. We can make animation keyframes. Let's go to close Duik window. And select these three puppets and these puppets. Click this icon. And click this icon for hide all layers. Nice. So, we have only two controllers left hand and right hand let's create first keyframe select this body press air and hold shift press p make new position keyframe and new rotation keyframe i will make loop animation only two or three seconds 
let's select this keyframes move to right okay and in this time let's change rotation like this and move to down okay and go to here let's move to down this and select this keyframe moved up let's see okay nice and in this time go to here change rotation like this okay let's select this controller go to here press p make new patching keyframe and move to here Okay, and go to here, move to here, left, like this, let's see, and go to last keyframe, let's move to down, and go to 3 keyframe, 1, 2, 3, move to up for bones effect, go to 3 keyframe again, 1, 2, 3, move to down, let's see. Okay, nice. Select all these keyframes. Make easy. Let's see. Okay, select these hand keyframes. Let's move to right. Let's see. Okay, this is very nice. Let's select these last three keyframes. Hold Alt, move to right for slow the keyframes. Let's see. Okay, nice. And select these body chain frames. Hold Alt, move to right. Let's see. Okay, and in this time, go to here. Make new person chain frame for this hand. Go to 10 chain frame. Move to down this hand. Or select this chain frame. First chain frame, Control C. Select this, Control V. Okay, and in this time, make new position and new rotation keyframe. Go to last keyframe, select first keyframes, Ctrl C, Ctrl V, and this Ctrl C, Ctrl V. Okay, nice. Let's see. Let's select work area, press N. Let's see again. Okay, very nice. So, in this time, Select this controller, right hand, go to here, press P, make new patching keyframe, and go to 5 keyframes, move to down, let's see, and in this time, make new patching keyframe, go to 5 keyframes, and move to up, let's see, and last keyframe, go to last keyframe, select first keyframe, Ctrl C, Ctrl V. Select key frames, make easy. Let's see. Okay, nice. So in this time, select this here, press air, make rotation key frame, and change rotation like this. Go to here, change rotation like this. Okay, and go to fifth key frames, make new rotation key frame. And go to again 5 keyframes, select first keyframe, Ctrl C, Ctrl V. Select keyframes, make easy. Let's see. Okay, select last keyframes, move to right. Okay, very nice. And select this here, hold shift, press P. Let's make 3 keyframes for bones effect. Make new patching shape frame, go to here, move to down, and go to last shape frame, select first shape frame, control C, control V, select shape frames, make easy. Let's see. Okay, select the three shape frames, control C, go to here, control V, and hold Alt, move to right for slow the shape frames. Let's see. Okay, nice dynamic animation with Duik Basil, and this is very easy way for rigging and for animation okay let's select these eyes press s click this icon and in this time make sketch a frame let's zoom 
and got 3k frame 1 to 3 chain scale 5 got 3k frame again 1 to 3 change 100 select key frames make easy let's see okay select key frames control c and let's move to here got here and again control v let's see nice and select this eyebrow let's press p make new position key frame go to here and move to up let's move to here okay and in this time make new position key frame let's go to first key frame select first key frame and move to down okay go to here and go to last key frame select first key frame control c control v full loop animation and make key frames easiest let's see nice so thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe channel like video and please follow me on instagram good luck